Good morning everybody. How fast can you install the Zebo? Let me show you. We can probably do this in less than 4 minutes and not 40 minutes like my previous video. There is obviously a lot of merit in why that video still exists and I would highly recommend that you still refer to it for more information. But this morning's video will focus on a automatic installation uh, method, a Zebo mod installer that was written uh, by Henrik. Uh, thank you sir, whoever you are, I do not know you, but I find this to be a very helpful utility. The link to the utility is in the description below. Once you guys click on it, you will come to this page on the GitHub. All you need to do is download the Zebo mod installer. As usual, uh, as per all my uh, tutorial videos I've placed it on the desktop you can put it anywhere else uh, for future use. The first step obviously is to run the executable file and the next step is to point it to your explain exe. This will then enable this installer to use the default Zebo recommended installation path obviously. So that means that in your explain 11 folder under aircraft it is going to look for and use the B737-800X folder. Alright, so if you have ever read the installation recommended by Zebo, you'll know this is the default path. If you have any add-ons in here like liveries, I've got a whole stack of liveries uh, if you are using X camera or if you are using uh, the native um, views then there are obviously a couple of things that you need to protect uh, X camera your preferences and your liveries um, comes to mind now this installer is not going to overwrite or delete any liveries or the active uh, or I beg your pardon the X camera um, uh, views but it will if there is a newer file available it will overwrite your b738 preferences file so if you have dedicated view set up in explain itself please protect uh, this file as well otherwise it will overwrite it and then you will have to uh, recreate your views again what you do next is you're going to have to select 4K or 2K for our purposes I'm just going to use 2K I do not use 4K right now then there's one of two things that you can do you can allow this installer to check your version of the Zebo against the currently available version of Zebo and then you can simply click install if you want to do a complete new installation then all you do is you ignore the update check. This will then go fetch the complete Zebo as it is available on the Google Drive and it is simply going to put it in the appropriate place overwriting everything that is in there. Just to show you how easy it is to do the update check I'm just going to remove this uh, tick from the checkbox and run the installer. As you can see it says it's already up to date skipping and exiting so I don't need to do anything. If I were to run the EXE again and I select uh, the checkbox then obviously like I said it's going to just pull the whole new version of uh, the Zebo mod overwriting everything that I have so you can then decide if you want to do an update check or do uh, a complete new install. Uh, please guys remember to protect the necessary files so enjoy and I hope um, to see you guys soon again.